Yo, 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 what is good, everybody? Yo, it's the Georgia Picker. Your boy has been busy, let me tell y'all. Um, yeah, it's it, <laughs> the past like week has just been insane. Uh, between doing all the storage units and or I guess one particular storage unit that was a lot, it was a handful, it was amazing. Uh, it just seems like luck is just on our side, uh, majority of the time. So, uh, but we're still gonna bring you guys the best content possible, but however. I do need you guys to go over to my new Instagram page, instagram.com slash the Georgia Picker. It'll be right here on the video. Uh, if you guys can, I'm going to show you guys um, when a video is currently premiering. It's also going to be showing um, certain pictures of, you know, me finding stuff in storage units and then random stuff that we find after the case. Uh, like, for instance, on my Instagram page, we found a uh, the Alchemist book. It was a first edition, and it goes for like a hundred bucks on eBay. So little things like that. That way, one, it will teach you guys a few things just in case you guys see it out there in the wild. Two, it'll help me because it's obviously saved photos on Instagram, right? And then three, obviously, I just want to educate a lot of people um, as well as. Uh, just showing some awesome finds you know because like i said at the end of the day that's the greatest thing about storage units we're trying to find stuff uh to flip for money stuff that is just amazing to find like the world war ii knife you know there's a lot of stuff that we have found in the past but um this unit was definitely i think it's really cool <laughs> so um but anyways i know it's a long intro i need you guys to hit the subscribe button hit the like button and then comment down below during this video um for some constructive criticism <laughs> so uh, anyways uh today is sunday and that means we have what sold during the weekend and we have quite a bit of sales um it's actually probably it's actually a decent weekend uh so we have 17 items going out for 507 dollars and 91 cents so we got to get to packing and we got to pull them or i'm sorry we got to pull then pack and then get them out shipped out for tomorrow morning. All right, so let's go ahead and get to work. All right, so we're gonna do this as quickly and efficiently as possible. All right, so the first thing that I sold, it was from the uh, the recent storage unit where we found all these Zoos Loose uh, vintage uh, single stitch t-shirts. We sold a Gorilla one, it was large, and uh, I literally put it up there for uh, a price that I thought I was, you know, I, I was comfortable with, and, uh, and it was really cool. And I will tell you guys, oh, show you guys what it looks like <laughs> uh yeah so this is uh this gorilla one i'll put the soul comp on the screen like always uh but this thing was really cool uh this right here this vintage zoos loose mountain gorilla single stitch vintage t-shirt sold for 29.99 plus shipping 37 dollars and four cents all in and this right here sold within five minutes let's go all right so as always the next two items going out is going to be going to separate buyers and it is the lifeline funko pop uh so we sold both of them for 3.99 a piece plus shipping so gotta always throw that in there but the next item going out this is from the southern living at home unit uh, at least that's what i'm calling it now <laughs> uh this is a fishes eddy green rooster mason jar uh, it's actually discontinued and uh, I looked it up it's gonna be on R6 um, but I looked it up and I realized it you know, it went for a little bit of money not anything crazy but um you know instead of putting it in a garage sale we uh, I figured it would sell and it sold within about 24 hours I believe um, we listed this the other day but uh, this is what it is right here it's a little fishes it's called fishes fish fishes Eddie I don't know but it is a mason jar uh, this right here sold for $9.99 plus shipping $22.56 all in on this mason jar. Next item going out is going to be a Funko Pop. It's going to be uh, Deadpool as Bob Ross number 319. So let's see if we can find it. It's actually very easy to find because he is <laughs> right here on top. There we go. So we got Deadpool as Bob Ross. He sold for $9.99 free shipping. All right, one of my more favorite items that uh, that sold this weekend. Um, I got this from a estate sale or in a estate sale. <laughs> um, it was that uh, Hershey S'mores Maker. Um, it was it was brand new open box. It's gonna be on R1. It's really cool. I think it's from 2000 and. 2005 i think i'm not 100 percent sure probably sat on it for a couple of months but this is what it looks like it's really cool you can actually do it for indoor and outdoor which is really cool for like s'mores um you know for like camping and whatnot um but yeah this is what it is it's really cool man uh i thought this thing was really cool i figured it was gonna sell maybe a little bit quicker but we did find some sold comps on it when we bought it and uh this bad boy right here sold for $39.99 plus shipping $53.97 all in on this s'mores maker. 
Next item going out is going to be from the unit where we found, I believe, all the amps, uh, those Luna guitars, the Ninja Blender, that, that unit. Uh, this is going to be a LG BPM35 Blu-ray disc player, and uh, it's going to be on R6. All right, guys, R6 is going to be right here. And if you guys notice, we've been filling up our, you know, filling a little bit of stuff up. We got some stuff over here going in the garage sales and and all that but we got some we still got a lot of work to do we got some poshmark stuff here um so we're trying to we're trying to get a lot of stuff listed but we're working on it though we we're doing really well and we cleared out a bunch of stuff here but we have a whole bunch of it here as you guys can see uh but anyways but yeah this uh blu-ray disc make uh, player sold for 17.49 plus shipping 33 dollars all in. All right, next item going out is going to be a Star Wars C-3PO and R2-D2 electronic bank from 1995. I've had this for quite some time. I'm pretty sure I'm already in the green. I uh, went to a garage sale. This is before I was recording. Um, so I've had this for a while. Uh, I bought a bunch of stuff, a bunch of Star Wars stuff for 50 bucks. So I'm pretty sure we're in the green on that deal. Uh, this is gonna be in B3. All right, B3 right here. And uh, yeah, this thing was taking up a lot of room. It is, the box is a little bit damaged. Um, but uh, it's really cool. This is what it looks like. Um, this bad boy right here sold for $17.49 plus shipping $26.54 all in on this bank. All right, next item going out is going to be a set of those uh, dumbbells that we got from the dumbbell unit where we found the bike. Um, what else we found? The big aquarium. And just a bunch of random stuff <laughs> uh basically the one where i was like yeah we got like 500 to like 700 dollars worth of weights right here um and i bought three units uh that day so <laughs> so yeah that's from that deal uh it's gonna be a set of two 12 pound dumbbells this one's gonna be on r5 all right you guys r5 should be right here and i'm pretty sure we can lift up this right here with one hand it's only 24 pounds your boy's a little strong um <laughs> but uh so yeah so this is a 24 pounds uh, this right here sold for $37.49 plus shipping $56.70 all in on these weights. Next item going out is going to be from the Southern Living at Home storage unit. And this is a Southern Living at Home dress me up tray. And it's going to be on R6. Like I said, we, we're selling a lot this week. <laughs> all right. So this is the dress me up tray right here. As you guys can see. So yeah, it's a big... It's a big package <laughs> so uh so this is really cool like i said the southern living at home stuff has been selling so that's always a good thing uh this right here sold for 16.99 plus shipping 28 dollars and 99 cents all in on this all right next item going out is going to be the original sizzix die cutter scrapbooking machine i got this from a garage sale i don't even know what i got it for maybe maybe five bucks maybe i'm not 100 percent sure but this is going to be in B4. And we have not stocked up these uh, these bins in a long time. So uh, <laughs> this stuff has been sitting for a little while. Um, let's see. Here we go. There it is. The big Sizzix. Which I think there's actually a thing missing out of it. Do not want to forget that. I'm pretty sure that's the piece there. Alright, but yeah. This is what it is right here. The Sizzix uh, scrapbook machine. This right here sold for $34.99. Free shipping. All right, next item going out. It's gonna be one of those uh, two-pack uh, Game Reverse uh, figurines. And as always, we've sold one of these for $9, free shipping. All right, next item going out is gonna be from the recent storage unit, uh, the, the Architect one. Uh, this is a Sony 2X floppy disk, uh, like external USB drive. Uh, didn't really think anything of it, but it was Sony. It's gonna be an M6. Um, <laughs> didn't think it was gonna go for anything. But we randomly found it and I listed it and it actually sold, you know, fairly quick. Uh, I think it sold within, I think, two days or so. Um, so, yeah, we've been listing a little bit. And, uh, yeah, this is what it looks like. It's just a floppy disk reader. We cleaned it up, cleaned up very good. And this sold for $24.99 plus shipping $33.49 all in. All right, next item going out is going to be another set of dumbbells. This is a set of two 20-pound uh, dumbbells. Um... And it's gonna be on R3. So we got two 20 pound dumbbells on R3. Um, but yeah, like I said, dumbbells will sell, man. Like it's insane what they sell for and they will sell decently quick. And I'm pretty sure these are it right here. 
I wonder if I can carry a 40 pounds. Let's see. I mean, I know it's easy on one dumbbell, but can I do it for two? Yes, I think we got it. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> it's a little hard. <laughs> now, if it was on one dumbbell, dumbbell, you know, your boy got it. But, but yeah, so these dumbbells right here sold for $54.99 plus shipping $78.60 all in on these dumbbells all right the next item going out i've had for quite some time it was another estate sale that i went to i believe i recorded uh it's where i found all those uh the brass darts the harley davidson bandanas some random animal plush and i don't remember what else um but a person messaged me and says hey would you do a set price for all four of them keep in mind i found six of them um, I was selling them for $12.99 a piece, but they asked, would you do uh, this much for all four of them? And I accepted. I, I feel like it was a, it was a good deal. Uh, this one's going to be in C2. And this is what they're going to look like. And so, yeah, there's six in here. I think I might have taken them all out. Maybe not. Let's see. Okay, yeah. So, I basically just had to pull out the four in here. Um, but this right here. So four of them sold for $8 a piece. So this right here sold for $32 free shipping for a total of four. So uh, just for some Harley Davidson bandana. So I'm happy with that. All right, now we have two more items left. The next item going out is gonna be Final Fantasy IX for the PS1. That should be up here somewhere. And, oh, there it is right there, right there on top. All right, very well. Uh, this bad boy right here sold for $10.95 free shipping. All right, and last but not least, this item came in right at the last second before we started recording. This is a 1967 through 1989 Cadillac uh, DeVille manual. Uh, it's gonna be on R1. We uh, believe we found this in the, the unit where we found the heater and the uh, Red Bull uh, cooler, um, the military unit. Um, yeah, pretty sure we found it in there. And this is what it looks like. Uh, these type of manuals always tend to do well. Sometimes they'll sit, some of them will sell quick. Uh, but I sold probably like five or six of these now. Uh, but this right here sold for $6.99 plus shipping $11 even all in. All right, guys, so that's going to be it. Uh, that's going to be everything that's going out for this weekend. If you guys did enjoy this video, hit the subscribe button. Please hit the like button. Comment down below. Give me some constructive criticism. If you guys want to see certain videos as well, comment down below and I will do my best to make it happen. Um, but yeah. Pretty good weekend overall. Hopefully everybody else's sales have been great. Uh, that's the greatest thing about eBay, man. It's a roller coaster. Some weekends you're going to have great sales. Some weekends you're not. Um, but yeah, but that's the end of the video. As always, it's your boy, the Georgia Picker, the Young Jedi. Peace.